All right, let's talk to Tony Stark. Hey, for what it's worth, I think you did okay out there. You got some decent hang time, even uh, given you were wearing, what, 70, 80 pounds of chainmail? On the Stark scale of reckless yet daring heroics, I give it a solid 6 out of 10. Don't worry, you'll get there. With a little help. <laughs> what? <laughs> will be nice. Your support is appreciated. Oh, no problem. I already got a few ideas cooking. You're not allergic to mimetic poly... You know what? Never mind. Why spoil the surprise? I, I couldn't help but overhear Auntie Caretaker over there telling you to get some rest. That uh, sounds like a good idea to me. Joke? <laughs> There's a joke option? Uh, what does this do? I do not have a quill. Even better. <laughs> Relax, Tony. I simply jest. It is an ink derived of the spider lily flower. Red spider lily flowers. Of course it was. Obviously. With just a touch of Manphibian blood for power. Haha! -ha, another zinger. And we'll just leave it at that. Well, I suppose I should leave before whatever monstrosity that is most definitely about rips my face off and then proceeds to feast on my soul. I'll leave you to it. May your sleep be filled with pleasant dreams, Tony. Right back at you. Oh, and if you hear the shrieking of a grown man, please ignore it. It's just me walking to my room. Oh, all right, let's open this presents. Hi, I'm Tony Stark, but if you're hearing this message, you already know that. When I'm not saving the world, I solve the world's problems with technological means, like the one you're holding. I call it the Spark, a secure information and communication device built only for superheroes. It does all the usual, private messages, pictures, and calls for some reason. But it also comes with access to Superlink, a private social network exclusively for your cape-wearing, world-saving... Superlink is your you connection to the rest of your team, a social network just for superheroes. Check Superlink frequently for updates from other heroes in the Abbey. I call it the Wonder Man rule. The Superlink. What do you mean? We had a uh, Superlink for months now. We use it every day. I mean, first post at uh, the Hunter Seas. <laughs> Rob, you can't keep doing this when someone new joins Superlink. Yes, I can. It means you will throw your spark in the lagoon. Robbie Ray. Blade. You wouldn't do that, right, Blade? Right, Blade? Fine, last time. Alright. <laughs> First, we make Wanda leave, and now we leave her to die. Some heroes. Ileana Rasputin. I assure you that is not the case. She was sent to you for protection. I see how that works. Supreme Sorcerer. Stephen Strange. Right, Doctor Strange. We both know it is more complicated than that, Ms. Rasputin. I took Wanda as my apprentice for a reason. Have faith she can handle herself. Strange did everything he could to get Wanda. So did I, and, uh, and the hunter. Take a breath, Eliana. We'll get her back soon enough. Wanda should be here with us. Of course. Of that, I am in agreement. Messages... Nope. Heroes... Okay, that's these are the four heroes that we have so far. Okay, so I assume that during one single mission, our health does not replenish uh, throughout the mission. But when we come back, I assume that we do, our house do replenish. Blade, Doctor Strange, this is where we are. We can interact with stuff. 
Loss earned from missions can be spent to unlock new cosmetic options for the hunter and heroes, including outfit, outfits to wear to wear around the abbey. Purchase a new abbey outfit for the hunter now. We'll go for the long sleeves, I guess. I don't really care too much about this. Inspect the journal. Aunt Sarah wants me to practice my letters, and so here I am. But every time I dip this pen in ink, I just want more and more to go out beyond the yard into my secret spots. I left my dolls scattered about before the storm, and I'm afraid they're hurt. Do dolls hold grudges? Agatha says they don't, but I still feel sad for them. My old journal. Maybe it is time I start writing in it again. Uh. Okay, this is item collection. <laughs> they. Why do they even have item collection? Inspect the painting. Why do they even have like so happy then. this stupid item collection in a like a, in a turn-based game? Uh, like to be honest, I don't really like uh, item collection. It's just it's just extra. Like, unnecessary playtime added. Alright, we're dreaming of the past. Agatha. Three hundred years. Oh, it must have been so hard on her. Not just her. I suppose that's why I might have been a little curt before. A little? You already made the ultimate sacrifice once. Maybe I'm in no rush to see you do it again. We do not choose our destiny. But we can choose to duck. <laughs> First lesson you ever taught me. And still the most important. Especially now that you have all these eyes on you. I have noticed. To these people, you are a being of myth and legend. Oh, my Grand God. <laughs> and they're right. You are a hero. I so want to skip this dialogue and just get straight to the gameplay. It's just... You need to decide what type of hero you will be. Ah... Uh. I mean, it's like if I want to watch a movie, I actually would watch a movie instead of <laughs> watching a movie in a video game. Don't forget about Agatha. I never could. Go to the forge. Restless all night. I should have known something was wrong. We'll talk more later. Spider-Man and his amazing friends unleash monster upon city. Garish Bleecker Street Manor, 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 sealed off by authorities. When the, when will the Spider-Man and his uh, pet Ink Monster and their trail of destruction through? Green, uh, Greenwich Village, and let's not forget about Disgrace, a certain Stephen Strange. Is he in cahoots with the web-slinging rounder? Did he hope to turn his uh, robo house into no house? 
Uh, okay. Are these just? Do they serve any type of? Do they give any type of information? Do they, are or they are they just random, like random lore stuff? Okay, this is bad Spider-Man. Don't let those words or the red and blue pajamas fool you, Spider-Man. It's no joke. Oh, looks like somebody made a friend. More like an enemy of an enemy. Starting to think we could use more of those. There's the uh, old Avengers uh, tolerate your spooky strange teammate that you have was looking for. I know who's going to for this month's uh, Team Spirit Award. Blade Cares. Hashtag Blade Cares. Alright, let's just head to the forge. Next thing I know, the sanctum is airborne and covered in slime. I don't get it. Strange couldn't just magic his way in. Now? Think you can tell your friend inside there to turn it up a few hundred Kelvin? I could. However, it might shatter the containment spell, preventing him from incinerating this facility. I think we're good. And just in time. The forge has certainly changed. Right. Caretaker said this all happened after your siesta. What spooky castle would be complete without its own Babylonian demon-powered furnace? Sumerian fire demon. His name is Babs. Oh, now it all makes sense. Well, once you get past the esoteric terror of the situation, I found this thing actually has some uses. Molecular bonding, breaking down evil gamma serums, fashion accessorizing. Mm, yes, speaking of. Oh, right. It's ready. Your armor seemed to offer minimal protection against the venom creature. Oh, okay. I thought you could use an upgrade. Well hammered, well fired. Caretaker did not mention that you two are such skilled smithies. Yep, I am Iron Smithy. Perhaps you should just <laughs> try it on. Iron Smithy. Wow. Still think I could have used a cloak. Okay. Stylish. Damn uh, oh, that's stressful. just a common combat suit. Not bad for our first collaboration. I still think it could have benefited from a cloak. I hate to admit it, but somehow this ancient forge puts any arc reactor I've got to show. Oh right. It's like, so damn <laughs> it's like just story piece after story piece. We're just like, oh my god. Can we just get on with the mission, please? Tell me about <laughs> why is there a demon? <laughs> why is it there? Well, you would probably know more about that than me. I'm still working on a way to keep track of everything that goes bump in the night around here. Whatever they've got trapped down there, it's hotter than hell by a few thousand Kelvin. Very pissed off and really good at weaving synthetic microblends. But tools are just one part of the equation. You got to know how to use them too. You were out, what, 300 years before we woke you from your eternal rest? I'm betting you have questions, so ask away, Hunter. Oh my god. Really? I take it this new version is a technological marvel? Impact resistant carbon composites, some patent pending alloy metal. Alright, we're gonna skip this. And hey, the built-in communicator means we can talk to each other without sending a raven. Sounds so impressive. It's a marvel, then. Sounds it's impressive. Really indestructible and modular enough for future upgrades. Frankly, I wouldn't have used your old suit to wax the Mandarin's car. All right.
You see anything strange? Strange around here. What other than my roommate? Boom! Roasted. But on a more serious note, this place is legitimately haunted. Mirrors look back at you. My room rearranges itself, and worst of all, magic cats. Okay. <laughs> You're not scared, are you? The Iron Man is not scared, is he? Let's just say I'll be more comfortable once I've studied the problem. I feel like I'm living on one of those paranormal investigation reality shows. All right. Thanks for catching me up on things. Anytime. Oh, and speaking of things, remember that uh, creepy gamma goop you found from that hopped up Hydra soldier? Well, I gave it a peek and it explains a lot. If you have a minute, meet me at the anvil over there and I'll walk you through it. I promise it'll be worth your time. More talking? Okay. Analyze the gamma coil. Now, I doubt advanced gamma thermodynamics was a hot topic at Yield Demon Hunting School, so I'm just gonna give you the condensed version. I appreciate that. Yes, please. The scene to this substance is pumping through Bruce's veins. Part gamma accelerant, part unknown element. Calling it coil for now, given its unique atomic structure. Man, I love acronyms. This stuff is more volatile than Nick Fury on a Monday morning, but Hydra doesn't seem to mind. They are using it to get stronger. Exactly. A few drops would make your average salamander look like Fin Fang Foom. Thankfully, with a little help from Dr. Spooky and our haunted oven over here, I think two can play at this game. You are not suggesting we start injecting ourselves with it? No, 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 no. Nothing like that. Though I can see some future applications for my energy drink line, I was thinking we apply this stuff towards upgrading our equipment. I like where this is going. Just give me a little time here and I can whip up some pretty fun toys. Okay, so is this is like the research place? For a change. Ooh, new coil. Let's get to work. Tony Stark can use the coil material recovered in combat to create hero all hero abilities. So new cards. Only one of the abilities on offer can be selected, so choose wisely. Okay, uh, they're just the same <laughs> as what we have. Um, I think whip is pretty, it's really good. Hunter, when you have a minute, come meet me in the yard. You have gained a copy of currently equipped ability. If taken to the yard, duplicate abilities can be combined with the new Okay. Okay. So it's a combining upgrade thing now, rather than the uh, like just upgrading. Okay, I have to upgrade it in the yard or something like that. <laughs> this is probably where we upgraded. Welcome to the yard. Yep. At least that's what we're calling it these days. Caretaker put me in charge of your training. Too bad she didn't listen to me yesterday. Now that we know what we're up against, I think we can all use the practice. Any questions? I did, but they are about you. Right when it's time to sure. From all Sarah told us about you, she never described you as lazy. Joke? Everyone loves you. Okay. <laughs> Tell me, does that mean you are half loved? Huh. She didn't describe you as a snarky jackass, but here we are. All right, Tony. A red blade is really. Questions. 
really serious. Tell me about the Midnight Suns. All right. Why did you join? Vampire hunting is a solitary affair. Guess I never found the right team. Is that all? No, but that's all I'll share for now. You really want to know? Put in the work. If I trust you, I'll have more to say. All right. Uh... Do you have any thoughts on the team as a whole? I think we're the only ones aware of the danger Lilith poses to this world. And I think we're pretty green. But enough training will get us through it. Speaking of training, we doing this or are we going to keep wasting daylight? Yeah, yeah, yeah let's go. Ready to train. Finally. Yep, we're just going to skip <laughs> a lot of dialogue. I, I think I don't really care too much. Ready for more? All right. Uh Okay, I can upgrade this. Cost two whips. 40 hero heroic essence and one training experience. Oh no, plus one training experience. Now this costs zero. This costs zero? Does that mean that we don't need to do anything? It doesn't count as a card play? Like the way you move out there, Hunter. Guess Doctor Strange picked the right supernatural demon hunter to resurrect. I'm Carol. Carol Danvers. But you can call me Captain Marvel. Kidding. Carol's fine. Just thought I'd throw a bone to the Avengers PR team. Not gonna lie. Going a few rounds in Vampire Guy's Magic Thunderdome sounds like fun, but we've got bigger fish to fry. Well, not so much fish as that ginormous invulnerable sewer monster that swallowed the Sanctum. Okay. That has to be a way inside. True, if only a man-eating alien demon monster hadn't eaten ours. But that got me thinking. Strange Caretaker and the rest of the funky bunch can try and magic their way through that shield all they want. If my time as a pilot taught me one thing, it's that sometimes you've got to find a workaround. As in Hydra, they've got to know the way inside. Steve's always said they aren't much for talking. But then again, I'm told I can be rather persuasive when I need to be. Not compared to me. As persuasive as I, Captain. I said you can call me Carol, and I wouldn't bet on that. You just woke up from a three hundred year nap. Okay. You've never seen me go binary on someone. Binary? Okay, I guess we do talk to them to increase the affection rating. War room when you're finished here. There's a few things we should discuss. Oh, and Hunter, welcome back from the dead. Nothing is certain these days, but these readings are too distinct to ignore. The gamma signature is... Sorry, Bruce, we lost you. Did you say gamma? Yes, get... Uh, hang on a second. Come on, Tony. You managed to stream the Super Bowl to a Kree battleship 50 light years out. This should be easy. Oh, we waited all year for that game, and you know the Skrulls would have spoiled it for us if they got the chance. Gamma signature is completely inverted. The daughter nuclei are being reabsorbed into the parent nuclei, which is impossible. If the gamma signature from the sanctum is really that unique, Bruce, then couldn't we just? I'm sorry, we're still working out a few gremlins in the system. Try sunlight, and whatever you do, avoid water. Oh, wait, 
You're being serious? <sighs> we should be able to track this okay. signature to its source then, right? I do it myself. Okay, it's an old kicking IT trouble today. <laughs> Please. Old Central here is ready to grind through that data like chunk. What exactly is a central? C E N T R A L. Cognitive encryption net transmodification. What? Uh, we'll figure it out later. Sending coordinates now. Hope your gremlins enjoy gamma spectroscopy. Ah, well, he's been a little moody lately, ever since, you know, the problem with the big old green. I guy. heard that. Banner can't turn into the Hulk. Not, Not sure, sure if we should be frightened or relieved. That makes two of us. Oh, hey. Come on. Happens to everyone. Well, okay, not everyone. Nice work, Bruce. I know that place. Creepy abandoned warehouse in the bad guy part of town. My favorite kind. Anybody up for paying it a visit? Definitely. Aw, see that? Teamwork goosebumps. Find me when you're ready. <laughs> Okay. Uh, okay, so the gamma stuff is for the hawk to transform. I guess that is something that we will be... Uh, that is gonna be something that we will... We, and we might be able to play as a hawk? Alright, let's go. Next mission. The Hudson Yards Development Restoration Association purchased this entire block. I'll let you think about that one for a minute. We don't get to play as strange this time. This this team is not very good. We have three. <laughs> we have three melee characters. I guess we have to go with this. There's no like we can't really choose. Oh my god. Okay, there's a slow mo <laughs> walk. French coat, sunglasses at night, brooding personality. Something tells me. All right, let's go. Come on, load, please. Stable isotopes aren't really in my wheelhouse, so we'll be patching Dr. Banner through from Avengers Tower once you reach the other side. Almost feels like cheating, you two on our side. Not bad for our first team up. So, it, it, I, I don't. Not sure if it's my. I guess it's my. PC that's doing this. It's like the the loading time. It's not very. It's not loading very quickly. And there's obviously the frame drops. But um, I think we'll just deal with it. I'm not sure uh, exactly how to solve it unless I upgrade my PC. <laughs> Yeah, so, okay. Right now, I play this game for about an hour and 30 minutes, and it's, it feels like there's more dialogue and more story stuff than actual gameplay, but... But, um... I mean, people do like the lore, and then since it is Marvel, right? Uh, 
kind of like part of the Marvel uh, universe. Abandoned off the description of this place. You seeing this, Bruce? Getting all sorts of weird down there. Johan Fanoff. That dick. I heard he was dead. Well, hoped is perhaps a more accurate description. Calls himself Faustus now. Dr. Faustus. <laughs> I just resident mad scientist. Not just Hydras, Liliths. That's magic coming from those crates. I can feel it. Yeah? How about gamma radiation? You feeling that too? Because that's some pretty evil looking Hydra tech down there. Gamma and magic. I need you to use your science brain on this one, Bruce. We need to approach this situation carefully. Combining those energies is an explosive at best. Then this is like the gamma lab in <laughs> Marvel Snap that turns everybody into the Hulk. I don't do stealth. Kill them. Why? Why didn't she just throw it down into the enemy? Device would have surely exploded otherwise. After Plenty of four. Learned it by watching you, Bruce. Draw cards until you have three in hand. You have two of those. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll do a quick slash. Hail that. This can't even kill. What does knee strike do? Oh, come on. Haunt. <laughs> Taunt and gain some block. I mean, I guess I can do that. That's a barrel that is gonna be really bad. We're just gonna do this. We're gonna retreat with blade. I'm gonna Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Didn't get didn't away the damage. So 
so they can always reach you. Is that it? Good. Tactics mode allows you to quickly access the entire battlefield and the condition of enemy units. I've never been one to buy into the science of magic, but the data I'm seeing is hard to ignore. There are more things in heaven and earth, Horatio. You know you're talking to a vampire, an alien hybrid, and a resurrected <laughs> demon hunter. <laughs> Um Your fate is sealed. This is weak, even for Hydra. You are lucky to still be breathing. Alright, we're let's draw. Time's up for these jumps. Okay, this thing does twenty four damage just straight up. Okay, more reinforcements. Okay, we have the zero class whip. The rate of decay within the particles themselves. How else could he be achieving such a high yield? I don't know, Bruce. I'll be sure to ask him when we're done punching out the bad guys. Uh, wait, let me. Okay, I can hit this. Is that truly your best? Okay, let's go quick slash. About time. It sounds to me like they just missed their mama. Alright, that, that heal is always good to have. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, what? She she's fine? Did 
Recover Hydra artifact. Retrieve the mysterious artifact from the truck. Break the Hydra shield guard's protection to access the truck. Use the Recover artifact card to secure the artifact. For the record, Bruce, I did not smash that thing. Noted, Carol. Perhaps you might direct all that energy towards your newfound adversaries instead. And the mysterious cargo they're attempting to escape with? Any op objective that is protected cannot be complete. Uh, reduce the uh, safe shield guard's block to zero in order to protect break protection. I can feel her corruption spreading. Alright, um... Do we have any quick? Let's let's use this. Exactly what I needed. Um Okay. Damage and taunt each enemy in a line. Can I move here? Okay, I think I can. It's just very... I can get the three. I I really want to get this this guy also in the in the front of me here. Yeah, I think it's fine. Captain Marvel can now go binary. Playing three Captain Marvel cards will draw the go binary ability. In her binary state, Captain Marvel will deal significantly more damage. All of her block has been removed. Hero is dazed and unable to attack. The other heroes must take a number of actions before the dazed effect wears off. Preliminary analysis of the blast confirms high levels of gamma and various unknown energies. Unknown to you, there is dark magic at work here. We must not let Hydra escape with it. This guy is still has the block. Immune to knockback. Alright, we're just gonna go for this.
One less thing to worry about. Approximately 16,342 more to go. I suggest starting with the remaining Hydra forces in your vicinity. I know, I know. Uh. Hmm. They use some of these things. Is that all? Okay, uh, that didn't do as much as I thought. We're gonna take some damage. <laughs> We're gonna take some damage. Okay, so this guy is like going for kind of a... I can't even kill that? Flash. That's a neat trick. Maybe you should teach me that one. Okay, let's go for the quick. Now that was something. Wait, didn't I thought it would explode. Damage in a line. Save this one just for you. I couldn't line up because I couldn't move. Oh, I should have just redrawn. Infuriating, even. By now, I'd normally be trying. 
tromping through the warehouse, hurling the puny truck at the moon. Don't worry, Bruce. I've got a pair of four metal pants with your name on them. It's a bad All right. <clears throat> what is this thing? Bad guy crate, full of bad guy stuff. I know those symbols from the time of the first hunt. That cliff means barrier. That one, almighty, something, something, gods and demons. So a spooky bad guy crate. Very spooky, designed to contain powerful magic. Be careful. Got it. Don't cross the streams. Never do. How about we get this thing back to the Abbey and see for ourselves? Okay, we only have two stars this time. Um... Do we know? Do I? How do I know? Like, how do I get three stars? And what's the maximum? There's no like maximum star count that I like. Maybe like three stars is not even the maximum star count. And here I'm just thinking that it is because three stars. Every game has three stars. That that would be the common knowledge of the maximum maximum star count, but maybe this game has more stars. Uh, yeah, and also I feel I feel like it's, so since we are doing some normal difficulty, um, like we only got a certain number of points for doing some normal difficulty, but if we do it on the harder difficulties, maybe like we would get more points towards more stars. And I'm not sure, like, I feel like the, the stars would align with how many, uh, how much of those, uh, the currencies that we, we, we would get. I think like the artifact and then the, the stuff for creating the cards. I think those are just uh, normal, uh, like you get them regardless, but I think the currency to buy like cosmetics and stuff, they're I think more, more, uh, nice job out there, kid. more rare, I didn't get Hydra -bombed until my tenth or more, more dependent on the kid. actual points that you get you know in the mission. Three centuries older than you, right? Then you've got a lot of catching up to do. Okay, Abbey Tournament tonight. Sure about that? Last one got a little heated. The Eternal Spirits of Vengeance take technical fouls very seriously, especially in the fourth quarter. Forget it. Tonight is movie night. It is always movie night. Exactly. Wow, out of jail again? Who made this game? Wilson Fisk? Well, if parking is free, we know one from Manhattan. They're playing Monopoly. All work and no play is how we ended up with Ultron. Come on, you should hang out. Are we actually going to play some mini games? 